don't clean your cat's litter pan with bleach because you'll accidentally create mustard gas and it's gonna really suck. <laughs> yeah, you can't do that. The answer is maybe a little surprising actually. Cat urine doesn't actually have a lot of ammonia in it. The ammonia smell comes from the urea in cat urine. In the litter box, urea will break down into ammonia with the help of bacteria that are present from being in a litter box. Also, cat urine is really concentrated because cats, they don't drink a lot of water. Fun little fact about cats. Some cats like to paw at or play with their water before they drink it. And that is just a reflex from hunting, essentially, and scavenging and making sure that it's a fresh water source and not just stagnant water sitting. So if the water is not moving, they're not sure they should drink it. So they move it themselves <laughs> and they feel okay drinking it. <laughs> Cats are wild. You have now both ammonia and urea concentrated in this litter box. If you mix bleach with ammonia, you get chloramine gases. And these are already toxic and terrible for you. But urea, urea makes it even worse. And this molecule can do some different chemistry. It's got a nitrogen and then another nitrogen. And then between these two nitrogens, like here, there's a carbon. And then that carbon has an oxygen that it's attached to. I know it's a lot of atoms, I'm sorry. So when you mix urea with sodium hypochlorite bleach, it actually goes through what's called the Hoffman rearrangement. And in this reaction, <laughs> the two nitrogens get stuck to each other and then the rest of the stuff goes away. Now, this new molecule with the two nitrogens attached to each other is called hydrazine and it's dangerous. It's like that special kind of dangerous because in addition to being incredibly toxic, it's also rocket fuel, among other things. So it's very flammable. Again, you're not gonna make enough probably that you're gonna have this kind of a problem, but you're probably gonna make enough to really seriously injure yourself because it's also super toxic. If breathing chloramine gas is already bad, breathing chloramine gas mixed with hydrazine gas is even worse. Ultimately, this is the reason why you should not clean a, litter, a cat's litter box with bleach. If you need to disinfect your cat's litter box, there are a bunch of different ways that you can do it. There are products that you can use that don't contain sodium hypochlorite bleach. Make sure you follow what they say to do on the label because those instructions usually are pretty legit. But before you do anything to that litter box, wash it with just soap and water. That's it. Yeah, it's really no joke. You can you can actually kind of hurt yourself with this one just because you're more likely to be kind of closer to what you're doing. So I really hope that I saved somebody a very, very terrible evening of choking and wheezing after trying to clean the cat's litter box. And until next time, this is Kim Thug.